Hey, what's going on guys and girls? I'm Kali Phoenix here and welcome to episode number 29 of my Subnautica Season 5 Let's Play series. So, as you can see, nothing really is out of the ordinary in this game at all. Um, I just come in here to put some stuff away. Um, put the salt in here and titanium. Uh, gold. Titanium. I'll put that in there as well, screw it. I'm starting to get a lot of random things in the titanium chest at this point. Alright. It's hot as hell in my office right now. By the way, if, yes, if you haven't noticed, we're swimming inside the base, so... I don't know what's up with that. Does it happen if we head into the moon pool room? Like, what happens if we go... Welcome aboard, and then come out? Okay. I'm on my feet. Was it just a weird glitch to do with the hatch? Because everything seems normal now. Curious. Maybe it did have to do with the hatch, because it happened when I came in through the hatch. Alright, let's try it. I like clipped into the bottom of the base, like I clipped into the floor or something. Okay. Alright, well, I guess it's a non-easily repeatable bug. Oh, wait, actually. No. I have no idea. I don't know how I did it. But I was floating at one point. So today, I want to head out to... Uh, life pod 12 and give that a look-see um, We've got 900 meter depth rating on this. We should be fine We've got 93 power. I Think we'll be more than good for traveling over here All right, so yeah, sorry about the lack of subnautica videos I've mentioned this in um, an arc video and a subsistence video as well that uh I've been mean, having a bit of financial stress and family troubles and stuff like that as of late um, so, I've been a bit preoccupied mentally and stuff to be doing YouTube videos, it's not that I didn't want to do them, it's just lack of, um, motivation and stuff when you, when you're stressed, so, go away sand shark. But yeah, that's, that's all I need to say about that topic anyway, just so you guys and girls know, I'm back. Um, everything might not be 100% back to normal, it might not be subnautica every day, I really don't know yet. I mean, the game's been pushed back release till January, so um, it may end up having to be a, a, a one last season, but I will not start that till the game goes officially 1.0. Uh, just, I'll just keep adding to this series until I think that they're definitely releasing on that certain date. So we can actually, you know, experience the true ending at some point. We've got a lot of bone sharks around here. What's this biome called? It's the Cooch. Cooch zone. Cooch zone. Oh. I think this is safe from like reapers, but there's these assholes around. I remember this. Let's see what we get out of this. How about you just fuck off? Wow, there's there's a lot of bone sharks. Repulsion cannon. Already in my PDA apparently, so I got some titanium. Oh, we got a PDA here. Now they redid these, so now they look a lot more. Yeah, you think? Um, yeah, they changed the way these look now, so, um, it looks like fucking torn apart, absolutely decimated now, which is a really cool effect rather than just the tiny little hole punched in it that there used to be. Right, let's go have a look around here a little bit. What's in this little cavern here? Oh, where do you go to? Oh. Oh. Interesting. I don't think I've ever been this way before. Oh, shit. I better run. Get 
get you repaired. There we go. Oh. I don't think I've ever come down this way. What do we got here? Creature egg. So what's all this basalt? Shale. Interesting. What is that? What are you? Ooh. I don't remember ever coming into this cave before in my life. This is interesting. Okay, so it does have a cutoff. At least this direction does. Uh, that goes back up. So does this, technically? No, it just stops. Looks like all of these end in a central point down here. I guess the only way to go is back. Let's head back. I think it was... Oh, well, actually... Does this head to? Does this just head around another direction? Yeah, kind of just stops here again. Uh, that's a little bit disappointing. I thought that went further. Oh no. Maybe it does. Sorry, my daughter was making some noise outside my door. I tried to tell her to make sure she's a little bit quiet. Whether she does listen or not, I don't know. So, you can get a lot of sulfur and shit down here, but it does seem like... I thought it would have gone all the way down. Somewhere. But that doesn't appear to be the case. Not anywhere I can see. Alright. Yeah, it's just not going to happen. Let's just try and get our way back out here. Alright. That was somewhat smooth. And now my dog's barking. Fucking great. Life gets better all the time. Shit, where the fuck... This way? Can I get out now? Uh oh. It wasn't the way, it's down. This way's the way out, I hope. Oh, thank god. Alright, well that's an interesting cavern. I wonder if you went down a different path, whether it would actually... Oh! hell are you doing man what are you doing what are you doing in this cave <laughs> you strange strange thing oh shit better watch out um it looks like there's a wreck here okay sorry about that my daughter's like playing right outside my door oh shit leave me alone you dick is there anything that would be in here that I haven't already gotten? Uh, do I have my laser cutter on me? Do. Let's see. I really wish there was a way to speed up stuff like this, like actually upgrade your things so it can cut things open faster or whatever that would be nice for end game at least uh, open storage nothing in there Is there anything here that's scannable what the fuck was the point of this room I think um I read that Rex like, uh, there's a few buggy things in this Subnautica release and that lately where there's, um, blueprints and stuff, fragments that you find. If you don't find all two or three of them in a play session and you save and quit, it will still wipe the progress of you getting them. So, that's, like, super shitty. So, hopefully if I get any fragments this episode, I get them all at the same time. And then I'll actually keep them. Quiet. Seems pretty dark in here too, doesn't it? Oh. Is that a Mesmer? 
Where's my like on? There it is. That was a mesmer, right? Those things are fucking creepy. I've only ever seen them open their mouths once and I freaked the fuck out. Oh shit, yeah. Uh, alien containment. Sweet! Even though I've already got it. 30 seconds. Oh shit, suppose I better figure out what my sea moth is. Right here. I hate when you're really close it doesn't show up at the icon because it's super dark and it's hard to see. Um, which way am I going home? This way. Alright. So I think that's actually something I want to do today is I want to get an alien containment area built. Um, it just reminded me to build one actually just by having that there. I just thought of building one. So yeah, I think that's what we're going to do today. We'll have to get some... Uh, some eggs and stuff together at some point so we can fill the alien containment with some really cool things this area is fucking awesome if it wasn't for so many things that can kill me i'd totally build something here what is that Ooh. there's a big old wreck here ah shit have i been in said wreck before Oh. Oh, this is interesting. Huh. It's actually in a grow bed on the ground. That's different. I don't think I've ever seen a wreck and that with a grow bed. Plants in it. Chilling outside. Uh, so what would be the way in though? Oh, there's something down here. Lightweight, high capacity tank. I think I've already got that as well. Unfortunately, we're just getting a lot of stuff we've already got. Which is a little bit disappointing, but... Oh well. I don't see anything in there. Hmm. Maybe we won't do the alien containment. Maybe we'll do that next episode. I'm kind of just having fun exploring these wrecks a little bit, because... There's got to be a way in. I know a lot of people who play this game every day, and that like I used to. Um... Or at least to probably put more hours in than me would know exactly where the fuck the hole is, but I have no idea. What is this? I'd stick fragment. Oh, there you go. Common bulb bush. Actually, we should get some of these plants and take them back with us. If we can, because it would be good to plant some stuff. And I think they look really nice. Uh, good. Alright. I think that looks good. Alright, so I think I'm going to head back to base. I'm going to plan a couple of these things and then we're going to end off the episode. Alright, guys and girls, we are back. Uh, I need to make another outdoor grow bed. Plant these plants in. Uh, could be better. There we go. That's pretty good. Right. Not bad at all, not bad at all. Oops. Okay, let's put this in there, this in there, this in there, and that in there. Unfortunately, I should have grabbed two of... You see, they're all pygmy bulb bushes. And we got a creature egg. Weird. When didn't like, some of them say common and some of them said pygmy? Why are they all pygmy now? Actually, it's, I want to have a look at something. Let's see what it looks like when these guys grow a little bit. That's pretty cool how they grow. Let's just have something to drink. Oh shit. Can I do this faster so we can see a better growth rate? Oh yeah, there we go. Man, they grow pretty slow. Look at that. It's like 1% every 2 seconds or something. They're not the fastest growers in the world. Oh shit, I'm gonna die. LOL! Idiot. I'm an idiot. I'm- oh my god, I can't even put this in now. <laughs> I'm too excited. Oh, you fucking idiot. Alright. Well, anyway guys and girls. 
that is going to be the end of this episode. If you liked it, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more Subnautica in the future, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Follow me on all my social media links down in the description below. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all have a lovely day. All right, poise. <laughs>